Hello everyone, today we're going to talk about fake portable air conditioners and how the HVAC industry is trying to fool us. So if you're watching this video before you buy a portable air conditioner, then I hope I save you a lot of money, a lot of wasted money, and I hope you also learn something. So what is all of this about? First of all, when you are looking for a portable air conditioner, I am looking for one at the moment and I've, I've been going to various websites, I've been browsing the products on Amazon and I've noticed that a lot of products and actually the majority of products that are listed on Amazon are fake portable air conditioners. They are not real products. And what do I mean with fake? So, let's first have a quick look at how a portable air conditioner works. A portable air conditioner has a duct system inside that contains a refrigerant, which is then compressed in a compressor. The, the compressing process um, extracts the, the heat energy from your room and then everything is blown out through an exhaust hose. So, a Portable air conditioner, just as a regular air conditioner, needs hoses, it needs ducts, it needs a compressor, all that kind of stuff. Without this stuff, air conditioning won't work. Technically, portable air conditioners are the very same thing as regular air conditioners. The only difference is that in portable air conditioners, everything, all the parts are assembled in, in one device and with a window mounted air conditioner, the, the regular kind of air conditioners, you have um, separate devices mounted inside and outside. But technically they work just the same. So I've been browsing on Amazon looking for a portable air conditioner and I've noticed tons of products Actually, the, the, the vast majority of products that are listed there that do not have an exhaust hose, that do not compress air, and that are way too small to actually, yeah, to, to actually represent an, an air conditioner. The only way air conditioning works is the way I just explained by compressing refrigerants, by extracting heat from the air and blowing that air outdoors. The, the products listed had none of this, these aspects and instead they were small portable devices, maybe two feet by one feet in size or some similar dimensions like this. And actually a regular air conditioner, a regular portable air conditioner must be a big solid heavy duty device, otherwise it won't work. These small portable devices that were listed on Amazon are all made in China. You can uh, instantly tell that they are fake because they have no BTU rating listed or mostly they don't have a BTU rating listed which, is, which represents the, the cooling power that the device has. Then um, also, they are oftentimes described as dehumidifiers or evaporative coolers, things like this. So why do these fake products not work? The reason is one of the laws of thermodynamics. It's the conservation of energy. And in our case, the conservation of heat. We have an enclosed system, which is our room. And in this enclosed system, we have a specific amount of heat. Now, it does not matter whatever you do inside this room. It does not matter which actions you take. You are physically not able to change the amount of heat inside this room. As long as the room is an enclosed system. So as long as your doors are closed and your windows are closed, no device 
in the whole universe, no matter how it's designed, will ever change the amount of heat in that room. It will never change the temperature in that room because it's claiming to be able to break a law of thermodynamics, which is physically impossible. So an air conditioner only works if the enclosed system is not enclosed anymore. For example, if you have a hose that, that is able to carry heat outdoors. I hope you get my point. Somehow the heat energy has to leave your room. Otherwise you will never be able to, to cool that room down. And that's the big scam of the HVAC industry right now. They are trying to sell fake portable air conditioners that do nothing. So what do you have to pay attention to when you're buying a portable space heater? When you're buying a portable space heater, then I highly suggest you before putting any device onto your shopping cart or before even buying it, um, to make sure that your portable air conditioner has at least one hose. Without a hose, it will never work. It's always a scam. Then make sure it has significant size, that it's a solid device. You want to make sure that this um, portable air conditioner has enough size and enough power to compress the air, to, com to compress the refrigerant uh, to in order to extract the heat from your room and vent it outdoors. So that's important. Portable air conditioners are always heavy duty devices. You will never get them in a, in a small version. At least you will never get one that has significant efficiency in a, in a small version. When you want to cool down a room with significant size, you also want a significantly sized portable air conditioner. I highly suggest you to look out for proven products where people know they, they work. Portable air conditioners with one hose do work, but with two hoses they have even higher efficiency. I link you two products in the description down below. One is an air conditioner with one hose from DeLonghi, which I recommend. And the other is a portable air conditioner with two hoses, which has higher efficiency from the brand Winter, which I would also recommend. Um, a short disclaimer, I don't own any of those yet. I am looking for a portable air conditioner myself as well, but in my location where I live, I'm in Germany right now, they are kind of expensive, so I'm still comparing the prices and I'm checking which shops sell them for for the best price but if you're in the us i would either recommend you the delonghi portable air conditioner or the winter portable air conditioner okay i hope this was helpful for you if you have any questions if you have any physical questions maybe even if you want to discuss about thermodynamics about the law of conservation of energy about fake portable air conditioners then just Put your questions in the comments down below. I'll try to answer them all and see you next time.